The body of famed 30s gangster John Dillinger is set to be exhumed, potentially putting an end to conspiracy theories suggesting he isn't buried in his concrete-encased grave in Indianapolis. Dillinger's nephew, Michael C. Thompson, had his permit approved by the Indiana State Department of Health, though a reason for the request was not included in the document. The exhumation is expected to take place at Crown Hill Cemetery on September 16th, some 85 years plus after Dillinger was fatally shot by FBI agents outside a theater in Chicago. It could prove challenging given that Dillinger's father had the casket reburied and capped with concrete and scrap iron, all covered with four reinforced concrete slabs. Afterward, his body is expected to be reinterred at the cemetery. Historian Susan Sutton of the Indiana Historical Society suggested the reason was to keep Dillinger's corpse from being stolen or desecrated, explaining, quote, the Dillingers had actually been offered money to lend out his body for exhibits, so they were concerned. Dan Silberman of a and &E Networks says an upcoming documentary on Dillinger for the History Channel will cover the exhumation of the body. Michael C. Thompson couldn't immediately be reached for comment, nor could the funeral director listed on the permit, or Jeffrey Scalf, whose grandmother was Dillinger's half-sister. A spokeswoman for the cemetery said Crown Hill had no information about the plans for his body to be exhumed.